Hello guys and welcome to the next part or whatever you want to call it just next to me just generally playing this game World of Tanks uh, I haven't played it well, I have played it recently I just haven't recorded I have been recording some Killing Floor I have another one of those to put up it'll probably be up by the time this one is out so yes um, so yeah I have joined the clan just a group of friends to set it up so I thought I would jump in it with them I bought my engine with my time. Yes, I have. So yes, there's that. My uh, Jack Panther needs need. <laughs> my Jack Panther is nearly upgraded again. Again, uh, is nearly got its next gun. I don't know whether I'm going to put the gun or tracks on. I don't think it's much necessary to put the tracks on because the weight difference is only 500. But yeah. So I am going to go jump in my Chinese tank, which I've upgraded. I think I might have upgraded it since the last time you saw me play. Well, I might have had this as the Type 38. Type 34, I mean. I will be going for the Type 59. I'm going to go through this route, go down then that one, and get the Type 32, and get the WZ-110, because these guns have got a lot better than the uh, heavies. So yes, straight in. So, Killing Floor seems like a success. Well, success-ish. Uh, people seem to want me to keep playing it, so I shall be doing that. If you haven't checked out my Killing Floor, go over and check him out. <coughs> Just to explain what you're seeing here, this is the new mods that I've installed on a community that I play with. Some guy uh, <coughs> put a pack in. Sorry, I've just got to clear my throat one sec. I'll be back in a second. And sorry about that. Probably like one second for you, not even that. Half a second. Um, yeah. So yeah, the the pack works as this. It comes with Jimbo's crosshair mods, HD maps, which you can see here. This, which is moved. Go? I don't know what's going on there. It's moved itself up. Um. Uh. Hmm. I have to look at that. Anyways, I'll see if it sticks around. I'll check the next map. But yeah. So you got this. It's got names on each tank now, so you know which one's which. You have a, a line on the map showing you where you're looking. You have this, which I haven't figured out what this is yet. I think it might be my view range. Because um, my signal range is a lot higher. Or it might be my signal range, I'm not sure. I can't figure it out. But anyways, so yeah, um, accurate damage indicator. And a few other ones. You've got a clock, which is there. Um, um, Jimbo's crosshair. Uh, Jimbo's contour lines which is heavy tanks orange, mediums are green, lights are yellow, and tank destroyers are blue. Artillery is maroon, I think that's maroon, I don't know. So yeah, it's quite an interesting little pack. He didn't create the mods, he just he just put them into a, uh, uh, a pack, and I downloaded it. So yeah, this gun that I've got on Type 38 is a pretty good gun. I enjoy it a lot. It's very well. It's a lot more accurate than the other guns that I've had in it. Um, it's quite high penetration, so it's quite a lot of fun to play with. So, not very high damage, but the fire rate makes up for that. Um, so yeah, I can't go through the Churchill Seven's armor. So yeah. So this tank. What the hell? What the hell could that be? Right, I'll call for some help. Let's go. Just go check out this base. Yeah, and this is where actually it tells you exactly how long you have left to get to the base before it is fully captured, which I enjoy. So it tells me how many people that are in there. Where the hell is he? I must be sitting just there. Uh, and they're obviously covering him. Don't like people who sit on there. It's a right noob spot. I'm just going to get hammered by their team now. Yeah. We've lost yeah, consumables are half price, so I've obviously bought a load. Yeah, my T49 was just camping up there. I didn't think he could still hit me. Anyways, so yeah, there's my mods explained. Um, yeah, mods, the mods, the mods, and that's about it. Really, nothing else new in this for me. I haven't really bought anything. I bought the KV1S, which I showed you. I've upgraded the gun. That's about it. Probably give this actually a go while I'm here. I need the tracks. Before I can upgrade any more, and I have to go for that. I'm gonna have to go, which I don't need to go for that. I've already got it. So yeah, happy days. Happy days with the oh, IS. Yes, I've, I've already got the best gun. So all I need is to get that, and then I'm then I'm cool. Which is handy. I'll probably have to get the tracks first, then go for that. 
IS-3, haven't got the best gun, but it doesn't really matter. Anyway, so there we go, I'll go in the KB-1S. So yes, this game has, is, uh, he's, he's got the Chinese tank since it's 8.3, apparently in 8.4 it is bringing in British tank destroyers. Um, so yes. I managed to think of a name actually finally for the part before this. I'm going to call it Banzai. I thought it was a pretty interesting name. I guess I think of another one for this. I might just do a focus on one of the tanks on in this one. So oh, sorry, sorry about all the creaking. It's my chair. I can't get comfortable. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to do that. Um, I'll probably focus on one tank in this. I might just do artillery or something, or um, maybe something else. I don't know. But yeah, I am going to head. Yeah, it's moved up. I wonder why. Can you move it? No, you can't. Time to roll out. Hmm. If somebody knows why this is doing this, you couldn't give me a, a, a tell, could you? Maybe I just need to restart my game. Maybe I'll do that in a sec. Once this game's over. And see if that fixes it. If it doesn't, then I have no idea. I might just delete this mod and then delete this one here. The enlarged map. And then I shall re put it on. So yeah, I'm, I'm heading towards this area up here. Um, it's really quite annoying, actually. I'm, I'm just destroying everything in my path. Probably know where I'm going now if the artillery is looking at me. But yeah, okay, everyone else is apparently leads on to one of the best tanks in the game, the IS-7. So I thought, oh, as it's on offer, I can buy one. Sorry about that. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Um, I shall be getting that in latter, latter, later, whatever, whatever you want to call it, in times to come. But, yeah, the IS-3 is apparently a great tank. So, yeah, I thought I would get it. Let's go for it. Let's go over here. Let's give this all a quick gander. Can I hit that? Oh well, might as well have taken a shot. Not gonna kill me. Oh, he's obviously going for those two tanks. SU one two two. I don't know why I just got shot by. I wish it would tell me. Sunny on the top left turret. Mm, no idea. But anyways. So yes. Look to do there's a Tiger P there, I can't really kill them. KV-2 I can kill. Um, I can kill a tight T-150 as well. <coughs> so yeah, I'll probably just hide or something, or do something, I don't know. Oh no, come on! Is that Tiger P AFK or something? That's really hard to tell. Try to get around behind him. That KV2 is probably going to get killed by this T29. Oh my god, he hasn't. It's my chance to kill him. No, I won't get to him in time. That doesn't matter. I'll just help out with this Tiger P. <coughs> Tiger P, I haven't muted my mic still. Good, it's still working. Tiger P, da 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 da. There we go, and bang. Yeah, this gun's got a shocking damage. Damage potential, so I'm just going to go for all his weak points. There we go. <coughs> what did he get killed by? Tiger, uh, Tiger P was killed by the Type 58. Which is a, what, what is the Type 58? Six, isn't it? Yeah, it's a six. Obviously, we've got a decent gun. Yeah, this tank's got quite good speed. That is about it. Yeah, this tight this KV2 is about to get ripped, ripped and off by all these people. Yeah, and this is another mod, the zoom out mod. It's quite a fun little one. Um, see if I can snipe him. No, I can't. I'm just gonna go down here. It makes it easier. Oh well, their artillery's there. Would have been my only kill probably. But anyways, yeah. So, 
up the hill. I can't see him still. Let's see while this aims. He's going to aim at me now. He's got six seconds to shoot me. Right, and so he was killed. Oh, right then. Their tank's all the way over there. Yeah, well, I did awful. This tank, I don't like it. It's got awful guns. Awful, awful guns. Awful. <coughs> Could upgrade it with free experience, actually. I do have 80, 80, 1000, I think I've got now. Or something stupid. Um, well, 82, actually. Look at me. So, yeah. Don't want to play that tank anymore. It's boring. My KV4, I don't know if I've showed you this, but I've upgraded it. Some more, I've got that on it. Don't, I don't know, I don't really, I just keep forgetting what I show you in the previous videos. But anyways, uh, you've got to still got to get the engine. And then I shall be moving on for the STI. I'm just going to play the Super Pershing and grind up myself some money. So, you can watch this. Just me. Get loads and loads and loads and loads of money. Uh, oh, balls, I forgot to look at what the time I started. Oh, I really remember that. Oh, anyways, oh, yay, fun matchmaking. I can kill everything. Maybe struggle with the uh, um, STI's front armour. Same with the AMX-15 and the M103. Because this gun's got shocking penetration values. It's 170. Yeah, I really want to know why it does this. It really annoys me. Hmm, it was. Shall I check it? I shall check why. Hmm. Okay, guys, I'll be back in a minute, guys. Um, I shall talk to you when I get back. Right, then, sorry about that. I had a phone call. Just somebody wondering something about stuff. Anyways, so yes. Um, right, then, let's go for this M103. Oh, yeah. oh, and he decided to move. Fun. Right, so, is that as far as I can zoom in? The only thing I don't like about this tank is its damage. Oh, there we go, I've been spotted. Yeah, I got um, my cruise goes up to 100% on this tank, which makes this tank a lot funner to play. A whole lot funner to play. Because its armour is good. But the thing is, if you get spotted and you don't know, you get fucked over big time. Um, so I'm just going to go for this Tiger. There we go. Hit on him. Somebody will kill him. Go for the M103. And reloading and fire. There you go. There's a shot. Don't think I'm spotted anymore. <coughs> and oh, missed. Anyway, the t is going to ram him. Let's just look this way, see if I can help these guys out. AMX, nope, can't hit him. Can't hit any of them, right, so I'll have to move up. Go for the KV-5. Right, so I've locked onto him. I'll just wait. Oh, there you go, I just took a pot shot while I'm still moving. And do one more. And now I'm going to stop here. Oh, no. Lorraine 40T, tier 9 against the tier 8. It really could do with some help. Oh no. Lorraine 40 is just going to go straight through me. I can't stop him practically. <coughs> Sorry, I need to have like a, a tickle in my throat. I can't seem to get rid of it. Right, let's go for the panther. Wait a sec. I just shot that rock. Or was I just shot at? I think I was just shot at. We've lost the target. I can't hit him, can I? No. no. So how am I getting spotted? There's no one to be spotted by. Oh, see, this is damaged. bollocks. Absolute bollocks. I'm going to plop myself here. Oh, or is that what's spotting? Is he shooting at me? No. Penetration. He's tracked, so he's alright. <coughs> I can't destroy the M12 in one shot, which is a bit of a nuisance. 
Oh, he's gonna get killed by our artillery. Um, just, yeah, see, there we go. So, I'm gonna go for the T-34. It's not fun to win against idiots. So apparently we're idiots. That's nice. Oh well, oh well, I don't care. Insult me, but we're winning. Ah, 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 ah. Suck on that one. So yes. Um, 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 ooh, Panther 2. Yet again, anybody who has this game, as I say every time I play this, tell me in the comments and I shall add you. If you tell me your name with that, I shall be able to add you. If you have Killing Floor, um, then I shall add you. Oh, that was an amazing shot. Kill Idiot 4502. Who the fuck's 40502? Right, let's go for this dude. I only have like 18 seconds, I knew if they're in there. Oh, right, that's why then. If some of them drop out, it'll probably take longer. Oh, there we go, there's one of them just dropped out. There's a few have dropped out of it, actually. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> <coughs> oh, wow, I don't know what that was. Sorry. Um, so yeah, this guy's probably gonna get killed by somebody. I'm gonna try and get a shot off on him. I doubt I will though. No, I could have taken the shot, but would have probably missed as it was anyway. Had a damaged fuel tank, so I'm gonna be going slower than I would have been. So yeah, and another one in the bag with more money. Hopefully, I can get to about what? I say four games maybe. Let's get see if I can get to five hundred thousand, and then I shall pause it. And maybe do a bit of killing floor recording. So that'll be three videos going up. Ooh, three videos. Fancy. But anyways, man. So. Ooh, yay. Matchmaking. Did alright for me. I was, I was surprised that they didn't actually uh, buff this tank. Because there's loads of votes on the forums for them to put the penetration up to 180. Which is the same as the Type 59s. And the Type 59, I think, has got better armour than this tank. Granted, the front armour on this tank is absolutely immense. Nothing can really go through it. I know Jag Tiger can. Most tier 10s can. But the ricocheting factor of it is amazing. I mean, I just get ricocheted all the time. Um, oh, I can't have got this volume too high. No. Uh, so, yeah. There's just the spaced armour. It just helps so much. See, they're probably going to avoid the town. I think the town's one of the best places to go. No one's gonna help me. I see everybody just sort of splits up, and then when they run through the town, the team just gets ripped apart because they just get flanked. How many tanks? I've got the ISU. He's coming to help. No, he's not. Type 59 is. Maybe. Help. No. Type 59 isn't. Hummel's looking at me, so that's alright. As long as I've got artillery cover, I should be fine. I'll probably spot something as I go over here. Well, I haven't been spotted. Yeah, I spotted him. The thing is with being in this courtyard, is the second I go in, artillery just rains down on you. And they can sit on that cliff over there and just snipe in on you. So you've got to put yourself in a really good little spot. I still haven't been spotted. This tank's already got quite a good camera rating. Still haven't been spotted. Now I have. He's probably going to try and get around the back of me. Ah, oh, you bastard. Oh. Come on. Oh. Well, I am going to have to repair that. So, let's get that done. Wrong button. No, wrong one again. There we go. I'm doing this in the dark, so... You have to excuse more. How oh, is that not a hit? There's like a 0% chance of me missing on that shot, and I managed to miss. 
And again, this is ridiculous. Oh, there we go, I'm spotted. I'm waiting for him to turn his turret around now. And I missed again. Wow, this is stupid. Wow, that one shot just went through my truck and hit my... Oh, no. Oh, so glad that T-52, 25T wasn't... 25-2, I'm sorry. It wasn't going for me. There you go, have fun going through my front armour there. Flashing. See, is there like an invisible wall there or something? If somebody can tell me in the comments, if, if there is somebody... If there is a way that I can't hit... There... Well, there goes our artillery, practically. This is just stupid. I told you, this is exactly what's going to happen. It's going to go through the centre of the place. And just rip through our team. Yep, nobody ever, ever pays attention. Back to base. Yeah, I don't know if that's something to do with the map itself, because it should be further down. I need them to spot them if they can see them at base. Then I can just shoot down on them. There he is. I'm still not spotted, which is good. How can I not hit him? Oh, what a noob. Oh, he's in a really... Oh, bollocks, bollocks. Oh, they're artillery. They don't have any artillery. I'm alright. Somebody please shoot him. Apparently there's a penetration, but it said no penetration. I should get the tank crews to say exactly the same as what happens. Well, we're not going to win, are we? Oh, we will actually. 23 seconds and we've got 53. I've obviously done something to this tank's accuracy. Very accurate tank. Yet, I just can't seem to hit them. There's obviously more than one in that base. We will win this now. No, we're not. We shall lose this now. Mm, there's, there's people in our base. In their base. Don't get shot again. There we go. We've lost. And I can't shoot anywhere in their base. In our base. IS-3's front arm is mental. Well, there we go. I told you that would happen. So, nothing unpredictable. And I still get a decent amount of credits. So, yes. There's that one. <sighs> so, then that wasn't an awful match for me, I guess. I got shot once by the M FCM. They managed to rip in half, rip, 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 rip through me. But uh, I couldn't seem to hit that Pershing or or that tank. It must have been like an invisible wall. I must have been just my shots must have been just missing or something. But yeah, so is that that annoying? But yeah, this is an alright map. There is I'm against tier sevens more than tier eights. The Hummel is the only thing I'm really worried about. Because I just seem to get targeted by artillery in this tank. Because the top arm on this tank, if you go through it, your tank literally just dies via Hummel. Because a Hummel's max damage is what, 1300, I think? Or 1000 something? Or something similar? Um, so, yeah. It's not too bad. Let's get this show on the road. Um. <laughs> Bum ba da dum. Oh yay, that guy's using gold ammo. Fun for him. 
Yes, this tank. I think, I think they made it a bit faster though, because I always seem to be going a little bit faster than it now. Unless this top speed is 30, not 20, which I thought it was 20. I'm going to zoom out, makes less noise. And I prefer the view from up here as well. See, I wish I could get in these little areas here. Like, sit in those bays and, like, ambush people. That'd be such a fun thing to do. They usually get the advantage here, because they usually can just sit there, which is what that guy's most likely going to do. Um, yeah, I just do this. I turn off here. Go down here. Usually encounter them, which any of their enemies which decide to try and flank us, which this guy is most likely done. And I'll shoot that. There you go. I'm just going to plot myself here. Well, there's a Tiger 2. If this guy knows how to play it. What the hell is this guy doing? What the hell is my turret doing all the way poking up in the air? I don't know why, why I would want it doing that, so why would it do it? This tiger's using gold ammo as well, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I just requested help from that tiger so he doesn't run off. I'm going to hopefully get this guy to shoot my armour as I come around this corner. Oh, of course he shoots the track. This guy's a mug. Absolute mug. So you watch him just come in this corner and aim at the top of my tank. Oh, this is ridiculous. Why isn't this Tiger 2 helping me with this KV-5? It's obviously a lot more dangerous target and he's just sitting there shooting at the easier target. Oh, this guy's freaking stupid. Absolutely stupid. Absolutely clueless. I'm, I just give up. I'm just gonna sit here like a pleb now and just sit here like this. Oh my god, what is this team doing? Oh my god, why are they not helping me? What is this? Oh, bleeding hell. Their artillery, our artillery just started to help us after though. We have practically just been swarmed to hell and back. Thanks for the help. You are such a great help. We just Let's practically turn around and die. Ready to fire. I don't see the target. The R artillery is useless. Oh, the KV-5 is overpowered, I'm sorry. Overpowered. Well, while well, this is making me angry, so I'm just going to go play some Killing Fort and probably record it. So, anyways, <coughs> that was me raging. As usual, not much difference there. Me and my Super Pershing, in my Type T34, and in me KV1S, which I did awful in. But anyways, so yes, thank you for watching. Please leave a comment, like and subscribe. If you have any tips, you know how to find me. If you wish to play, you know what to do. If you've added my brother, my brother's Steam account as on, uh, sent, uh, let's start that again. If you've added my brother's, oh, I don't know what I'm trying to say. If you've added 
Weetabix as a friend on Steam and I haven't accepted, send me put a comment in the section below so I know it's you because I don't I don't know all your names off by heart. I don't know all hundred and fifteen. I think I've got now. And yes, thank you for hitting a hundred subscribers. I I I thank you very much. Um, I did have one hundred and sixteen, but someone unsubscribed. Most gutting moment I think I've had in a while. Anyways, so yes, thank you and. I shall see you in Killing Floor. Bye the byes.